Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Friday 6th of January 2023. This trade were shared by HS who is trading Nasdaq CFD using Forex Broker. As you see his macro 30 minute chart is showing a strong uptrend and breakout happened at this point. And he took several position here using a channel that is shown here on one minute structural chart. So the trading channel on the structural chart is like this and we see that momentum is very strong so using tick chart a smaller trading time frame he used first this channel of the trading and took two positions at this points using exit strategy number one again another pullback happened and the trade was taken another deeper pullback happened here and again he took this channel here uh, one good quick position a scalp with profit so thank you hs for sharing your trades with us the next few trades were shared by sam or global instructor from australia who's trading micro nasdaq futures and as you see here the larger channel here is showing a structural channel which is in uptrend and is shown here in this area and you see the smaller swings within each one which is a trading chart of one minute and you can see that using price action algo trading i'll go one to five every pullback was taken uh, with long positions and you can see the entry points here with the blue arrow and also exits with the red arrow trades from one single chart was copied to multiple apex trading accounts and you see here the total uh, profit and loss with commissions and net profit loss with 81% win rate. So thank you very much, Sam, for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades were shared by Yan, or global instructor, trading micro NASDAQ futures. You see his macro chart is showing a very wide sideways volatile range. He waited for the price to test this level in the structural chart. And after breakout here, the channel of the downtrend started to emerge and sellers came back. So he started to sell short each pullback uh, using this new channel that is forming downward. And we see how the ATM and manually he managed every position. Another pullback here with entry. And we see again trade management didn't reach their stop. And is trailing now the atm okay the next position another pullback came with break even another deeper pullback and the sellers came back so he entered and this worked very well the summary of all these trades is shown here that he reached profit factor of 41.24 with 89 percent win rate and we see the average win to loss ratio was about five and the largest winning trade was 195 and the largest losing trade was 24. So thank you Yan for sharing all your trades with us. These are some of my trades during the New York market session trading NASDAQ futures and the video that I posted to the group so we can listen to that now. As you see uh, yesterday market volatility was very high in uh, sideways and during the globex session it went down and tested this level and then it got rejected uh, due to some economic uh, news around 8 30 so we had a lot of news today uh, then i traded around 9 30 this area when the market went down and retested this level around 10,780 on nasdaq and get bounced so buyers came back and i started taking long positions and then uh, stop it just before the news uh, this was one trade that the news helped to push the price higher and the result was copied to multiple apex uh, founded accounts and the result of the day is profit factor was infinite because there was no uh, losing trade and we had 100 percent winning trade and average win to loss ratio cannot be calculated because no losing trade therefore profit factor goes to infinite and is shown as 99 here uh, so average 
winning trade was 172 and the largest winning trade was 680 dollars and these are all average for multiple accounts so i hope these trades taken by the path system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions have a wonderful day and weekend ahead